We'll kill you, Larry. What do we have here? Well, this is a 1922 Model T fire truck. It's on a car chassis. Uh, it is not a TT, so it's one that uh, fits in a regular garage. Uh, I've had this car for you know, a couple of years now, and it is just one magnificent Model T. It has a 2627 engine, which is the best engine Ford ever made for a Model T. Uh, it does have a Ruxtel rear end, which is a two-speed rear end, a uh, highly sought-after accessory uh, for any Model T. It has a running board spotlight and Super. Bells, you have to have bells, and you have to have uh, whistles on Model Ts. What about the whistle? Well, it's not a whistle, oh, it's sorry. an air horn. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. <laughs> okay. I want one of those on my truck. Now, uh, just like the old Laurel and Hardy movies, you have to have lots of bells and whistles and horns. We have an electric siren. <laughs> Uga horn. <laughs> Model T horn. <laughs> and on the other side, we have a Bosch electric uh, horn and a hand siren, a hand crank. Never can tell when you might need a, uh, a hand crank siren when your electric one goes out. Well, let's hear that. <laughs> That's great, Larry. Another bell on, on this side. Uh, while we're looking into the cockpit here, you can see it has a stick in the center, which was the uh, Ruxtel rear end. That is the shifter for the two speed rear end. This is, uh, I've had a lot of Model T's before, and this is by far the best operating Ruxtel uh, rear end I've ever had. Another fire extinguisher. Of course, we have axe on both sides. And this is a hose truck. So it's to pull up and it, uh, hook up to a fire uh, source, or excuse me, up to a water source, and uh, hopefully put the fire out. I read one time about a fire truck that was going to a fire in uh, out in a farm someplace, and <laughs> had, by gosh, by the time they got there, it was the chicken coop that burned to the ground, so they had fried chicken the next day. <laughs> you got a bench seat here, and you use this for parades? A uh, bench seat for parades, or for firemen as needed, and they have been converted to uh, storage on both sides for jacks and any accessories that are needed to put out fires. Cuter and heck. Okay, Larry, what about this motor? Well, this is a 1927 Model T Ford engine. That's the strongest Model T engine made was in 26 and 27. Uh, normally, from the factory, they had a thermo siphon which means the hot water goes to the top and the cold goes to the bottom for water circulation. But we do have a water pump. You can see two of the horns in here. And uh, I'm using the regular Model T coils. Some cars have been converted to a uh, distributor, but this has uh, model, regular Model T coils in it. Super. Okay, Larry, any time. <laughs>
out. <laughs> and watch for that airbag. <laughs> Well, you know how to drive this thing. Well, I've driven them all over the United States and Canada and Europe, so wow. it's, uh, that's a fun car to drive. <laughs> Runs good. <laughs> Great, super. Try not to hit my thunderbird. Yeah. Well, thank you, Larry. That was great.